Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Thanks for watching. Today we're going to be going over my shower care routine. Um, but first, of course, let's start with my nail of the day. And today I'm wearing OPI's Emotions. And it is a liquid sand, and you can't see how beautiful it is in the bottle, unfortunately, but on the nail, it is just gorgeous. It is matte, and it is sparkly, and it is just everything you can ask for in a black polish. So today on my hair, I have my first day hair, and I follow the curling products um, that I filmed previously and I will link that below for you guys if you're interested in watching. Uh, the only difference was is that I used flaxseed gel instead of my curling gel souffle. So if you guys are interested in seeing what I use when I take my showers, uh, please keep watching. So to start with, um, let's go through what I use for shampoo. I always use a sulfate free shampoo and my favorite brand is Shea Moisture. Now this is the Curl and Shine shampoo and I really like this stuff. Um, my absolute favorite from the brand is actually their Moisture Retention. The Moisture Retention reminds me more of a co-wash than an actual shampoo where the Curl and Shine will actually lather up a little bit for you. So if you need that lather in there, um, I recommend trying out the Curl and Shine shampoo for you. Then I move on to my Holy Grail conditioner, conditioner and it's the Generic Value Products uh, Conditioning Balm. And I actually got this off of recommendation from YouTube and I love this stuff. My hair really responds well to it. Um, I use it by just, um, it's basically my rinse out. I don't rinse it all the way out but um, I will run my head completely under cold water and um, detangle my hair a little bit with that in my um, with that in my hair, and then I will move on to using both my Tresemme Naturals. It's the Nourishing Moisture Conditioner and a Suave Naturals. I use those together in basically a modified squish to condition. With the Suave Naturals, I don't have a set type that I use. I've been really enjoying this Aloe and Water Lily as it seems to really reduce the frizz um, that I experience. The kind that I will switch off between is the Suave Nat or Tropical Coconut. And that's the one that I actually started out with. I feel like um, when I just want to co-wash, that is the perfect one for co-washing. The Aloe and Water Lily will work for co-washing, but I don't feel like it uh, cleans quite as well. But so what I'll do is I mix the aloe or the Suave Naturals with the Tresemme Naturals and I just run that through my hair and I flip my head over and I'll squish that in and um, it's basically like the squish to condition method um, but what I'll do is while my head is still upside down I will allow some of the cold water to run on the very back of my head and then I squish that in as it runs down my hair. Um, so I'll rinse out a little bit because I find that it can weigh my hair down a little bit. If I don't rinse it out um, and leave as much as I do in or as um, it recommends to leave in, it's not bad, but um, and my curls are very defined, but I find that I have absolutely no volume and I struggle with volume enough as is. So I feel like if I rinse a little bit out, at least it um, allows my hair to um, pop up a little bit more and breathe. So then I get out of the shower and I continue on with my um, styling care uh, routine as, as uh, I showed in my previous video. So uh, like I said before, if you're interested in that, I'm definitely linking that below. Um, other than that, that is basically my shower routine. It's nothing fancy. It's pretty easy. Um, I am actually going to be trying out a new conditioner here, I believe, after I run out of my Tresemme Naturals. Um, I haven't been overly satisfied with it. It works, but I've been really wanting to try out the um, Say Yes to Carrots, I think it is. Um, so if I do end up trying that out, I will definitely update and let you guys know how I like that brand um, over this Tresemme Naturals. 
Uh, if you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comments below. Um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, I'd love if you subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.